Hey, aloha, this is Harry from Kailua. I'm gonna fulfill another request from a student. Um, she wants to learn Somewhere Over the Rainbow by Iz. So I've decided I'm gonna do the Iz version, and then on the next show, I'm gonna do the Wizard of Oz version. So here's a close up for the Iz. Okay, so to learn Somewhere Over the Rainbow by Iz, we're gonna need eight chords. So here's a, the eight chords you need. Here's C, we need E minor, a minor, a F, a G, a D suspended 11, a E7, and a D minor. So if you didn't get it, just rewind. <laughs> okay. So we're going to learn this song in sections. So um, first thing you need to know is the way that is strummed. So this is a reggae strum. <clears throat> so I want you to count one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and. And now, as you count like this, just to get your right hand or to feel it, just tap on two and and four and like this. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three. Four. Change it to a strum. You can strum with your thumb. One, two, and three, four, and or a finger middle finger, any finger, two fingers. The more fingers you use, the louder it gets. But this is the reggae strum, one, two, and three, four, and one, two. That's the big general idea. Sometimes you hear it strummed on one as well. So you might strum like one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and, okay? So here's uh, the intro. Um, it's, uh, well, I'll list the, the chords underneath on the limb. So here we go. Here's the intro. One, two, and three, four, and 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 C, two, and three, G, two, and three, four, and A minor, two, and three. B suspended 11, F, two, and three, four, F, two, and three, four. Okay, so we'll do it again. This is uh, the intro before the O section. So one, two, and three, four, and 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 C, two, and three, four, and G, two, and three, four, and A minor, two, and three. So we'll do it one more time, but here, um, the reason why it'd be good to hold the A minor with your middle finger is so that when you put your ring finger here, you got D suspended 11, and then you change that to your first finger, you get F. Yeah. So here's the intro one more time. Uh, C, two and three, four and E minor, two and three, four and A minor, F, two and three, four and C, two and three, four and G, two and three, four, A minor. There's the suspended 11, F, two and three, four. So I call that the OO section that's uh, done also at the end of the song. So I wrote in tablature um, the melody of when he sings the OO so that you can uh, teach yourself how to sing this. So here's the first part. So I'll do the, um, the ooh section again. This time I'll sing the melody that I, uh, the tab will still be there. I'll just do strum the chords and each, each chord is the strumming of one, two, and three, four, and, okay? So one, two, and three, four, and. Ooh. Okay. 
Now we're going to learn uh, the first verse. So I'll list the, again the melody there for you, like somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, and the dreams that you dreamed of once in a lullaby. So we won't have to do this the whole song, but I'm going to list it there so that you can always rewind and teach yourself how to sing the song. Okay, so here's the first verse. So one, two, and three. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, and the dreams that you dream. section. Someday I'll wish upon a star, wake up where the clouds are far behind me, where troubled notes like lemon drops, high above the chimney top, that's where you find me. So, yeah, let's do a quick review. And then, um, so I'll start from the, yeah, I'll start from the beginning of the song. And I'm just going to continue on and then I'll just keep uh, listing the tab underneath and the words so, and the chords so you can just follow along. Okay, so here's the intro. One, two, and three, four, and C, two, and three, four, and E minor. Somewhere of the Rainbow, then he goes into uh, What a Wonderful World, originally done by Louis Armstrong. So I guess I have to do another show and teach you 
uh, uh, Louis Armstrong's version, I guess. So anyway, here's his version. And again, here's the... Well, I see trees of green and red roses too. I'll watch them bloom for me and you. Okay, so I'll just list it, then you sing along and rewind if you need to. So here is What a Wonderful World, the continuation. Well, I see trees of green and red roses too. I'll watch them bloom for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Well, I see skies of blue and clouds of white and the brightness of day. And I like the dark and I think to myself, what a wonderful world. There's the next section. The colors of the rainbow, so pretty in the sky are also on the faces of people passing by. I see friends shaking hands singing, how do you do? They're really saying, I, I love you. And then he goes back to the first, uh, this verse. I hear babies cry and I watch them grow. They'll learn much more than we'll know And I think to myself What a wonderful world, world Someday I wish upon a star Wake up where the clouds are far behind Me, where troubles but like lemon drops High above the chimney top, that's where you'll find me, oh, somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. And the dream that you dare to, why, oh, why can't I? So check that and we'll learn the Oz version and I'll also find the Louis Armstrong's version of uh, What a Wonderful World. Check back. Aloha.